Hello team, Blake Sargent here and today I'm going to help answer a question we get pretty regularly which is should I have multiple sites? Now often when um, you know when I speak to practice owners and healthcare professionals they've found themselves naturally in a place where they're doing a little bit here, a little bit there. It's quite rare that I come across somebody who is in one place full-time, i.e. a business owner. It's different if you're an employee, but we've got people who sort of do bits in the NHS and they're working for one clinic here and they're an associate there. You know, and it's, you know, we, we then ask, well, look, moving forwards, is it better to have multiple sites? Because sometimes we think, well, multiple sites, that gives me more security. It gives me more range, right? I can actually treat people in different areas and that way, you know, I've got a, a bigger pool of people to pull from. But whilst that may there may be merits to that argument here's what we found with multiple sites it's hard to focus and if we use the example of a magnifying glass on the the day or two of the year that it's warm enough in the uk and sunny enough if we hold a, um, a magnifying glass in one place we can actually create a fire Whereas if we move a magnifying glass around, we warm up some stuff, we warm up a whole area, but we don't actually really create that spark. And the thing with multiple sites is it's really multiple businesses. And we have a, a phrase in the hive which says, you know, you, you can't ride uh, two horses with one arse. You know, quite simply, if you have two sites, only 50% energy can go into one and 50% can go into the building of the other. So really when we ask, should I have multiple sites? The first place we really need to think about is where do we want to be in the future? Because if you want to build a private practice that can ultimately work without you, if you want to be able to build something that is just beyond you, i.e. not just a job, then it's a really important question to ask because it's like building two restaurants, you know? Isn't it easier just to build one? You know, it's one website, one set of marketing. Whereas if we have two sites or like two restaurants, it's, it's two businesses. You know, it's two different pools of people. It's two different websites, two sets of marketing, two sets of patients, you know, and you can't split yourself between the two. Um, so look, some of you might find yourself in that scenario where you currently have multiple sites, but the question to ask is where do we want to be in the future? So have a think about that and think to yourself, well, look, if ultimately I want something that can start working without me, then having one place with one team, like building a sports team, if you had a, you know, if you play for multiple different teams, you're never going to get that great. Whereas if you focus with one team and you build one world-class team, you can have incredible performance. Hope that helps.